Hello everybody, it's Rhino and I am here at Disney's Animal Kingdom in Dino Land USA and I am here to do a Disney Dining Show quick take and today there is actually a special, you can see the A-frame for it right there next to my shoulder, there's a special uh, Sunday here to celebrate uh, Raya and the Last Dragon which uh, if you haven't seen the preview for it, check it out. It is going to be in theaters and on Disney Plus um, in March, somewhere mid-March. Um, so some snacks have popped up here at Animal Kingdom to celebrate. And you know what? It's hot outside. I have been running a lot lately. I've been outside walking around all day today. I'm treating myself today. I know I shouldn't be eating food like this right now, but uh, I'm doing it. I'm getting the Sunday. I don't I don't even care. I'm gonna I'm gonna dive in. Let's go, let's go check it out and see what that A-frame says it is. But before I do that, I just want to remind everybody that this and everything we do here at the Disney Dining Channel, the Diz, the Diz Unplugged, is brought to you by Dreams Unlimited Travel. They are experts at helping you plan the perfect Disney vacation. Be sure to visit them on the web at dreamsunlimitedtravel.com. If you book with them, it costs you nothing extra on your trip and you help support the show. So we appreciate that. Uh, and enough of that now, time for some ice cream. So there is no mobile order, so we just gotta walk up and order at the window like the old-fashioned way. Baby Tuck Tuck ice cream. It is described as a yummy sundae built for speed. Chai spiced caramel cake, chai caramel sauce, vanilla ice cream, green tea cake crumbles, salted caramel crispy pearls, and an edible image of Baby Tuck Tuck for $6.99. So he's pretty cute. I'm gonna eat you, buddy. Sorry. All right, I got the sundae. It was a pretty painless procedure you walked up in order it's not a mobile order it is in total was 6.99 it was 7.45 after tax it looks good it is this whole bowl with a big heaping scoop of ice cream in here um, and it is warm in my hand it is hot so i am going to give this a try this is a big piece of cake and a lot of ice cream Okay, it is very, that chai flavor really comes through really strong. Mm -hmm. I'm digging the pearls for texture. They add a nice little pop. Um, the ice cream's delicious. We can't go wrong with our standard issue vanilla bean ice cream, right? Mm. And then, I don't know, this is good. I don't even remember the last time I had an ice cream sundae, so. This is super indulgent for me right now, but. The, the spice cake with all of the, like with the caramel sauce and the ice cream and everything, it's kind of like got that consistency of bread pudding, um, but there is a lot of spice cake. Like there is a lot, it is dripping in here. And the spice cake is very, like really has that spice to it. Not like spicy, spicy, obviously not heat spice. And there is another flavor in here. And I'm gonna assume it's the green tea, but I can't figure out if it's complimenting it or if it's just adding a weird flavor. I don't know. I'm into it so far. I gotta keep eating though and let you know what it's all it's all about. There is, oh my gosh, this, this cake is so big. There is so much cake here. It's like this thick. It's like crazy. That is so much cake. But it is a good cake. It is a really good, really nice, soft. I'm not gonna say the other word. I'll never say it. I'm loving the chai. So this, this piece of Tuck Tuck in here is pretty, pretty big. Pretty big chunk of white chocolate. Look, look. A little like hard to get through with the spoon. So you might have to like crack it, then break it up and eat it with that if you want to eat it all together. You can save it for the end, for a little taste at the end. So I'm done now. Uh, I finished the sundae and I don't know why I was so wishy-washy on it. I did really enjoy it, honestly. I liked it because it was something different. Um, I really enjoyed that. Uh, I thought the caramel sauce was good on it. It wasn't like overly thick, if that makes any sense. You know how sometimes you get caramel sauce and it's like, it feels like, it reminds me of like tar, like you're pulling on it. Um, it was hot, so that was that was nice. It was a really good contrast to that nice cold ice cream, which I really, really wanted. And of course it was, you know, quality, hard scooped vanilla bean ice cream. So I was, I was really, 
I was really into that. And then the uh, chai caramel sauce, like I just said. It was interesting that the chai flavor was in the sauce, but also the chai spiced cake. It was a really good, well-cooked um, cake. And honestly, I, I thought that it was gonna be like a really thin layer of cake, you know, bare minimum, but it was like, like you saw in the video, like thick, Slice, and it was good. It didn't feel like a oh, stale old cake that we're hiding by microwaving with with ice cream. It was like just the right density to it. So, um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna recommend it. I, I think it's got some unique flavors. If you are not a fan of chai, do not. I would not recommend it for you because um, it definitely leans into that chai, that chai flavor for sure. And not just like the spice of chai, like all the way in. So if you love chai, like I do, I think I think it's worth trying. So. Uh, give it a try. I'm not sure how long it's going to be here for. So uh, check it out as I'd say sooner rather than later. But my guess is it'll at least be here through the opening of the movie. So um, you probably have a little bit of time. But again, that is at... Uh, I can't believe it, it was literally right behind me in this entire video. Dino Bite Snacks. I can't believe it was right behind me and I forgot the name of it. I could have just read it in this video. Clearly the sun is getting to me here. But if you're not familiar with this, it's right next to Restaurant Asaurus over here. Again, Dinoland USA, Disney's Animal Kingdom. Check it out. Let me know what you think if you have it. I'd be really curious to get your, your takes and your opinions on it. Um, and if you see any other like cool, fun snacks, please let us know. I would love to try some things out. Any cool vegan food anybody's tried anywhere recently too? I'd really like to try some of that. Um, I'm on that, that plant-based journey, so. Although obviously this was not plant-based over here, but I do believe you can get plant-based ice cream either over here or at the, the um, Trillo Bites up the, up the way over here. I know there is somewhere right around here you can get it. So there is some stuff here uh, for the plant-based folks as well. Um, so again, that is gonna do it for me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to the channel. And as always, comments, all that fun stuff. Uh, I, think that's, uh, I think that's everything. That's my whole spiel, so. I'm gonna go and get in the shade and I hope you are all having a, a, a great day and staying happy, safe, and healthy. I will see you next time. Bye.